Hello once again everyone and welcome back to Manhunt Checkpoint. I'm I found myself an Oracle, so I'm quite happy with this car. This is probably one of the best cars available, I think, for, for me in this game. Because it looks pretty nondescript. It could just be a generic boring saloon car. Um, but it's actually in the uh, coupe class, which means it's pretty quick, handles quite nicely, and generally is an all-round quite good car. So I'm happy with that. Um, and we've also decided to skip the, um, the checkpoint up by the casino because, well, I've not been doing very well recently and so we've I've kind of got bored of that checkpoint to want to do a different one. So we're starting with the one that's in downtown by the by the over underpass bit. And I'm trying to decide what the best way to approach it is. And I think probably from the east this time. And I feel like I might have just rolled a dice to work that one out. But um, I think that's it's, it's a direction that I haven't done before. But I'm sort of in the right place to do so this time. So let's give that a shot. I'm down in ghetto at the moment, uh, in sort of the, I think it's, it's a hospital or a police station on, on the left, I'm not sure, but slanty car park anyway. So what I'm going to try and do, you can just about make it out on the map there, is I'm going to take the uh, the second right, Oop, let's try and actually stick with traffic, second right, and then probably the second left after that, yeah, and that should take me along towards the, towards the, um, the checkpoint. And hopefully allow me to take it without the, without the uh, hunters noticing me. Uh, and that's um, a bit of a tall order because they uh, they seem to be doing quite well today, which is why I'm struggling. Actually, better idea. Maybe what if I um, if instead of turning turning left um, directly opposite the checkpoint, if instead I carry on a bit further north. There was a police car there. Didn't know we got those. I hope he doesn't twig that I'm driving a stolen car. I don't want to have to be dealing with the police as well as hunters. That wouldn't be fair. For what seems a little bit incongruous, he's sitting there. In fact, there's two of them sitting there at a red light with his um, siren on. That does seem a bit odd. He's looking at me. I don't like it. <laughs> Go. Why do cars do that sometimes? It's a bit strange. They uh, they'll um, they'll get to a junction and then they'll pull out into it as the lights go green. Then they'll wait until they go red again and then um, and then they'll finally go. Very annoying. Okay, there's Tristan in the pur with the purple underglows, and that's one of the nice things about the time of day changing. Um, sometimes we get night time, which means we see the uh, the funky lights. Now this is where I was considering turning left to go down that road because that will lead me straight to the checkpoint. It's two blocks away. But given that Tristan's patrolling up and down here like this, I'm not going to do that. Because <laughs> that way lies suicide. It's an extremely bad idea. So I'm going to wait for the green light. Him to get distracted by all of these cars. And I'm going to make a bid for freedom. And hope he didn't notice me. Yeah, I don't think he did notice me. Okay, so we're going for plan... Um, I don't know letters. <laughs> Plan whatever the next letter in the alphabet is, which is which was the one where I'm going to go down this road, and then cut, turn left to go along under the under under the underpass. Uh, so I need to. There's nobody around. I don't think I'm just going to go. We've done a bit of a different thing for this um, for this run, and I haven't really experienced it yet because I've been driving quite carefully. But the um, the damage cars take has been significantly boosted. All the car's toughness has been reduced. See, uh, look at it whichever way you like. Either way, it means, um, well, all the cars, theirs and mine, once you start crashing them in a chase, they're going to fall apart a lot more quickly. And we're going to have probably have some issues with that. Okay, there's a green light. Let's just take it. Ooh, an F620. I like them. There's a car with lights off there. That worries me. I don't think it's a hunter though. And to be honest, hunters shouldn't have their lights off. They should be making themselves as obvious as possible because that's the, sort of the point. There's purple again. And green. I don't like this. As a AI being dumb, I'm out of here. I've given myself away now, so we're going to have a chase. Turn my lights off, see if that helps. It does mean that if. If they see a shadow hooning across the um, across
across the city, car with no lights on, then they're going to be suspicious of it. Although, as I pointed out a, a moment ago, there are AI cars with their lights off as well. So lights off doesn't mean it's me. But it also... It's one of those things that, even though it's not actually a dead giveaway, it looks suspicious and is going to put the hunters on their, on their guard. That said, I feel like I've escaped. I've not done very much damage to this car, so I'm going to keep it. This is probably going to be my undoing and is potentially a rather unwise decision. But I think I can now reasonably quickly just head down and, and, and start thinking about trying to take checkpoint number three. And for your sake and my sake, I don't want to mess around too much. That's another one of those that looks like... Yeah. Damn it. It's another one of those... That lo it, looks like, it looks like an exemplar from the side and from the rear. But when you get in it, it turns out it's a sports car, so I'm not allowed to use it. Hey, which is I'm kind of annoying. I'm glad the AI like my car. <laughs> Even with the, uh, the, the few dents I've managed to pick up. Uh, I'm still in fourth place. I'm going to risk the red light. Okay, so the next checkpoint is down into Ghetto, and last time I tried to approach basically from the um, from the east because that seemed like a good way to do it, um, because then you can come in and try and grab it without hopefully without too much um, aggro from the hunters. There's, there's, there's some fairly major roads in that way, but the problem is fairly major roads tend to mean hunters keeping an eye on them. So I'm not going to do that this time. I'm going to try and come in from the north, basically from checkpoint two, as if I'd gone straight due south from taking the last one um, and I think that should allow that should drop me more or less right so I'll come yeah I'll drop in, into into the ghetto and then if I go straight forwards across through a little bit of off-roading down an alleyway that'll drop me right on the uh, checkpoint hopefully without being too obvious about it and I say obvious, if this, it's, it's the usual thing, if they see me coming out of the alleyway, then I'm I'm done for, well, I'm, I'm really, really obvious, they'll spot it to me immediately, because, you know, AI cars don't pop out of alleyways like that, so it's, it's just, it's blatant, especially as I'll probably be going quite quickly, because I want to take the checkpoint reasonably, reasonably quickly, so that, that I'm not lurking around being suspicious for too long. Now, I could... That's not my green light. Oh well, <laughs> never mind. Um, I could get out of the car and, and... Ooh. That was a purple car. I could get out of the car and see if it's possible to take it on foot without actually leaving the alleyway. That might be fun. There's that purple car. It's coming back. I don't like this. Oh, it's not purple. It's green. They've all got the same colour underglow, so I can't tell the difference between them. He's hanging around here, I don't like this. Can I have a green light, please? Especially as we're all dressed. I don't have any control over how I dress, so... Yeah, he's just orbiting me. Oh no, he's, he's gone away. Maybe he didn't tweet it was me. Either that, or he's doing a very good job of pretending. I'm going to go because I don't want to sit here any longer. Oh shush. Okay, so my cunning plan is to get to this junction here, have a bit of a look around, and if there's no hunters in sight, I'm going to go into the alleyway across there. Okay, there's the checkpoint. Now this is our either going to go very, very well or very, very badly. What's that nice jump? Okay. Um, place your bets now, ladies and gentlemen. Can I climb this? Can I climb this? Oh, climb, climb the damn wall. Okay, I can't climb that wall. So I'm going to see if I can sneak around and take the checkpoint from off-road. Okay, that's the road there. That's... That sounds like a hunter. I wonder if they found my car. Ooh, a cat. Hello, cat. Don't give me away. Meow. I need 
need to hide. I need to hide. Move quicker, move quicker. Hide. Okay, he hasn't spotted me, but he is lurking around in this area and he's definitely suspicious. Um, <laughs> this is such a bad idea. Is that an abandoned purple car? It's not moving very much. No, that's moving. It is moving. I'll take it back. There's two of them over there. Okay, I don't want to go that way. I wish I could just do the pretend to be a civilian sort of thing. I can hide in a bush. That's an idea. If I'm here... <laughs> oh, God. I wish I could see around that corner. There goes purple. He's very suspicious because he knows... His, their position indicators are changing as they go past, so they know that I'm in this area somewhere. And they're getting very, very paranoid because they can't find me. That... That blob just isn't quite big enough. Is he going to turn around? Yes, he is, because he's noticed his position's changed again. So that, that, I was hoping that that um, checkpoint blob was going to be big enough that I'd be able to um, sneakily take the checkpoint without running out into the middle of the road. Okay, he's going. There we go! <laughs> okay, I didn't actually run out into the middle of the road, but I have taken it. So they should now... I think it takes a, a few seconds for them to be notified that I've taken the checkpoint. So, I'm just going to carry on enjoying this lovely bush. No, I'm not. I'm going to run back and hope that my car's still there. I'm going to go the long way around and go all the way around these um, bin storage. Oh, yeah, I've so taking a checkpoint on foot. Did that? My car just just despawned as it came into view. Then, hacks. <laughs> I like that car. Um. I wonder if I could use this pump trolley as a car. I don't want to... Um, hang on, this, this, is a, this is a bad place to be stealing a car, actually. It's, it's the main road out of the ghetto. Although the next checkpoint is off that way, so they're probably going to be going... Ooh, let's, let's have this little... Um, no, let's... Is that, ooh, is that another oracle? Yes, it is. Excellent. It's even a slightly different colour. Okay, very happy with this car. <laughs> Close the door, please. There we go. Oh, whew. <laughs> I'm so pleased that worked. <laughs> I have to admit, I was not sure that was a... Well, it probably wasn't a sensible idea, but I am so happy that it, that it actually worked in the end. I wonder if it's possible to take the Chinese monument checkpoint in the same sort of way. So the next checkpoint is over, is over by Chinese monument, and there's a sudden... It's sort of on the... No, I don't think it is. I think there's too much there's too much open space and sort of general parkland type stuff around it. So it's it's, it's in a it's in a big green area. So I'm not going to be able to um, sneak it like I did with that one. But, oh, that was satisfying. I think when Tristan was going back and forth past me, I think he must have managed to convince himself that even though his position indicator was changing, there wasn't anybody there. So I must have been off in a in a different direction. Same distance from the checkpoint, sure, but in a different direction. And so that meant that he was um, felt happy to go off the uh, in somewhere else and go and go and search somewhere else for me. <laughs> oh, I one I think the most satisfying thing about that, apart from getting a checkpoint in a weird and unusual way that I hadn't done before. Oh, oh. There's two of them. feel like I sort of... Is that... No, it's not Pete right behind me. It's a banshee. I don't like this. There's too many cars here and lots of cars are together. Is the sign of a player. Uh, and also... 
That's a hunter. I don't like this. I don't know whether he's recognised me or not. No, I don't think he has. Okay. I think he thinks I'm still dressed as Michael. Because in the last run, we... we so, with the mode we're playing in at the moment, there are some sort of... There are a few a few bugs we need to we need to work out. Some things that need to be improved, I think, is probably the best way to put it. One of those is is the costumes we, we wear. So at the moment, there are basically there's there's two ways a player can be dressed when they spawn in. There's either this guy in the uh, the flannel shirt and he has a backpack at least when he's out of the car, or there's a sort of guy who's dressed as a skater in a bright yellow t-shirt, and you. Each time you spawn, you, you, you seem to pick get one of those randomly. Um, there also seems to be a way to sort of finagle the game into having you change into be dressed as Michael from single player. Um, ooh, what are you doing? Obviously changing lanes, but um, so you can yeah you can do that and and that's how that's how I was dressed in the last run. And I think that might mean that Tristan in the purple car is expecting me to still be dressed like that. And if so, that could give me a convenient advantage because if I'm not dressed the way he expects then when he looks in a car he's going to completely ignore this guy even though he alternatively I'll just give myself away because he'll pull out of a car park right in front of me and I'll drive into him um, now I'm wondering now at this point Maybe he did recognise me, and despite the fact I was um, dressed differently, maybe he did recognise me, and so um, that's and so he was actually just sitting there waiting for me. In which case, that is an impressive amount of cunning. And I mean, yes, he could tell that I was. Oh, that's a bad slide. Um, yeah, and it, it was probably reasonably obvious that I was going to carry on along there in a straight line, straight towards the checkpoint, and probably try and take the checkpoint. So it's a fairly safe thing to do if he had recognised me. To try in an attempt, presumably in an attempt to try and get the um, the other hunters into the area, because as I know I've said in the past, I can't remember if I said it in this video, but the hunters are far more effective on mass. And, oh, I've just realised why my car was going so badly. Um, <laughs> this is the um, aforementioned damage, and I don't know if you noticed uh, because I abandoned the car at about the same time as it happened, but the. Um, engine warning lights had, had come on in my car so I'd actually smashed it a, couple, a few too many times and and severely broken it to the point where it wasn't responding anymore which is why it was going so slowly <laughs> that's quite interesting I'm also wondering if that's why Tristan disappeared whether he had a couple too many crashes and his car was just sort of disintegrating around him interesting I'm um, that's the first time I've noticed the extra damage thing in this because I've been, I've been driving fairly carefully and trying to look like an AI and so on, as is always the way in this. And so I hadn't been giving it a great deal of thought, but I just noticed then that my car was lagging horribly, or lugging horribly rather. It just didn't have the turn of speed I was expecting from it. And so, yeah, maybe that's because of the, um, the extra car damage thing. That's that's very interesting. I'm going to have to keep an eye on that, and um, next time I have an accident. I'm, but I think also, I'm not going to go the same way into Chinese Monument Checkpoint again, um, because I did get spotted that time. That's not seen one of those cars before. Um, yeah, because I did get spotted, so I think it's probably worth changing my angle of attack. And swinging around to where am I? Okay, so I'm a lot further north now. I'm north of the um, north of the highway. I need to turn. Yeah, if I take this next. Hang on, that's not Chinese Monument. Just a minute. <laughs> Oh no, it is Chinese Monument. No, I, I, I take it back. I was, I was right the first time. I think I probably, in that case, I probably want to turn left here. Which 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 bridge is this? Where am I? I haven't quite... Uh, not straight drop down. Actually, no, maybe I'll carry on to the next one. 
I'll be in the correct lane. Uh, I'll go with the lane I'm in. So many nice cars, and I'm not allowed to use any of them. <laughs> the bullets are lovely. The uh, even more so the um, what was it? A um, it's not a fuse lane. The other one, that white one. Um, I can't remember what it's called, but yeah, they're good. <laughs> and I wish I could use one, but no, it's 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 a sports car. I'm happy with my Oracle, really. It's, it's, even though it's the second one I've driven, and they're probably going to start expecting me to be driving Oracles. No, third one I've driven actually. There's, it's been just an oracles all the way through. <laughs> uh, been oracles all along, yes. Uh, okay, so now this is getting this is getting to the bridge I was decided I wanted to go over. So go over here, straight on. That'll drop me right onto the Chinese monument um, checkpoint. There it is. You can see the red glow through the trees ahead of me. Am I in the correct lane? No. Let's try this lane instead then. Yeah, so I'm not going to do anything particularly clever this time. I'm going to just trundle down the, down the road towards the checkpoint, take the checkpoint, and then run away from the hunters if required. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't think there's... there's not. I feel like there isn't really anything particularly clever I can do around here. It's a bit too open. It's a bit too much of an open space. So I think just going in and taking this one in the traditional way <laughs> sneaky sneaky sprinty sprinty is going to be my best bet here um, from here I can then blast on down towards the airport that's possibly my best way of escape or at least I say towards the airport not actually into the airport but down through the spaghetti junction down that way around Maze Bank Arena and I don't know I'll just see how it goes because you know it it's a no contact survive no plan survives first contact with the enemy so once the, uh, the hunters spot me or I spot the hunters all of my plans are probably going to change. Okay, about 30 miles an hour, so I don't look too obvious. A green light about now would be extremely helpful. Or I could just do this. Because I think that's probably a better idea. <laughs> then I just flee down this way and have to then try and think of something evasive to do like uh, this Oops. that was not the evasive maneuver I intended I could hide but oh I have wrecked this car That's just that is very interesting that yeah so that I smashed into. Yeah, I say I, I smashed my car into one concrete barrier and now it's destroyed, as if that's a surprise. But it, I mean, it kind of is because I've got used, so used to GTA that having to replace a car just because you drove into a single concrete wall is a bit weird. I, I think I like it. It's definitely interesting. I'm also really, really exposed here. Um, so I'm a bit nervous about jumping out and taking and, and going to grab another car. So what I think I'll do, if I wait for the lights to go red, like that, and for something to turn up, I didn't want it to be a truck, but you know what, I'll take it, just to get me Holy out lights. of here. If they see me in a truck, Damn, I'm doomed, because there's no real way to escape. However... It's better than standing at the side of the road looking like a lemon. There's another oracle. I feel I've done oracles quite enough now. I should perhaps do something a bit different. Is that a Prima? Ooh, yes, that black one at the back. That's a Washington. I don't want that. Okay, it's, yeah, it's, it's no, it's, it is a, it is a. Oh no, it's Zion. He's better. Right. Okay. Zion. Very happy with that. It's another. It's another one of the sort of the um, subtle coupe class, should we call them, for want of a better name. Right. Plans. 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 So the next one. The next one is an interesting one because there are two different places I can take it, assuming the checkpoint's been set up properly, which I'm, I'm sure it has been. It's again in the over underpass area, so the high, what we call higher higher lower. And that mean, and and in this this particular one, you can take either higher or lower. 
and successfully take the uh, successfully take the checkpoint. I don't know what they're going to be expecting me to do. I kind of want to drive through. Oh, I'm only in second place anyway. I can't take it yet. I need to um, give them a bit of time, or just you know drive away from it myself, or drive by. See if I can see where they're lurking. So yeah, if I go along here, this is Red Car Park. So where am I? Yeah. So if I go along here, another block. If I turn, if I took the next left, not this one, but that left over there, then that will bring me up directly. No, no, sorry, it's two blocks further on. <laughs> okay, the map is useful. If I go, if I go up two blocks further on, oh, I've got fourth place. That's right then. Um, yeah, I can look and see if I can spot any of the hunters, and that'll give me an idea of whether I want to go high or low. And I can then make a snap decision and then regret it for the rest of the game. <laughs> it's, a, it's a red light, that's sort of convenient. There's Buck over there on the corner. Sitting still for some reason. Interesting. Um, I don't see any of the others. I'll see if I can spot them as I go around the corner, but that's this difficult because happening. I'm not great at pointing cameras at, me, again, at aiming the oh, there we go, right turn, light. Okay, I'm going to go lower. Is that purple ahead of me? No, I don't think it was. Okay, that's the checkpoint. There's nobody behind me. Right turn on a red. Perfectly legitimate manoeuvre. Excellent. Suspicious looking purple car right behind me. Pushing me off the road. Road. He's he's just wrecked my car. Oh. No, don't sneak. Run. Okay, it's hiding a bush time again. Oh, he spotted me. Damn it. <laughs> oh. Okay. So the um the easily damaged cars thing is quite good. But if you get smacked like that, then you're in trouble. You're first, are you, Pete? Yeah. Here's checkpoint sort of distance. It's dark at the moment. Probably worth checking the cars around checkpoint there. It's night time. Didn't see it. Uh, going through the checkpoint, heading west. Heading north, east of Red Car Park. Two east of Red Car Park. I've lost him. Grey saloon car. Might have been him, but I'm really not sure. Uh, I think he's he's probably to the south because fourth, and I'm really close to the I checkpoint. I just went through the checkpoint, and I'm second. Hey, okay. you're not first. Second. That might have been him going yeah. past. Bad. Ready to ram no, something. Take... Is someone else first? I'm first. Okay. What? I'm being shot. Hang on. Out of here. 
the hell was that? Bum, I, bum, 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 I just bum, crashed bum, on. a bird flew into my car. <laughs> what? There's now a dead bird on the road. <laughs> is it by my front right wheel, Buck? I don't see it. Um, Are you okay? By my front left wheel now. Yeah, no, I don't see it. Okay. There's no bird there. Huh. There's just a su sudden squawk and it. Oh but no, it's way behind you. It's here on the road. Huh. It didn't. It didn't move with you for me, at least. It's on here. Yeah. Still edible, I think. I'll let you try. All right. Don't mind if I do. Uh, right, I'm first. I'm third on the checkpoint. Yes. Me, you, and Pete. Are you? Are you first, second, or third? I've just. I've just gone third, fourth. Uh, right on the. Uh, where am I? You, eastern. Uh, he is very close. It feels like he's been close for a while. Morning has broken. Right, I just jumped from fourth to second. Like There's a camper here. What position are you, Buck? I'm first. About okay, so he's away. fourth at the moment. I think he's got spooked and gone away. So this is where the yeah. camper van spawns, I think. Alright. Makes sense, since it's here. There's two camper fans here. Third. Second. Fourth. Oh, he's taking the checkpoint. Oh, damn it. Not paying attention. I think he was hiding nearby and waiting yes. just to scatter slightly. I suspect there is correctness in your assessment. Lindsay Circus and Ginger Street. Oh. Don't look for a drive. I was going to be suspicious of that car, but it's a banshee. I get the feeling he's going on the other side. He's not got that I mean, close yet. Hello. I'm get my light. I recognise this character model. Oh, no, uh, by red car parks outside. You found him? Yep. Right, heading down. Now it's the more tactical, uh, try and get him, follow him carefully and try and have him make mistakes. So he can switch cars? Yes, yeah. but his car can get, also get damaged. My car feels slow. Where are you? Uh, we had north from Red Car Park, uh, higher lower and I've lost him. Oh. Uh, heading south in higher lower. What's he okay. driving? Uh, sedan. Dark. Right. Uh, there's a check engine light. Uh, heading east, past Square of Squares, but I've lost sight of him. Okay, I've just passed the uh, red car park. Why is this car got the door open? He has to be Why close. Why is that car it's just pulled past? That one. Uh, uh, he's just taking a black yeah. sedan heading. Yeah, that one. Heading south. 
didn't see where he went though. Nor did I. He'll have turned by now. Pretty close. Oh, we took it. He's taken it. He's not up there. He wasn't down here either. Is it the red van? It could be the red van. Go no, after that. Red. No, it's uh, square squares, not side square squares. Northwest corner of square squares. Can someone come and kill him, please? <laughs> okay. Coming. You got him. He's on foot in square of squares. Come on, stop climbing over things. He's in this push. Maybe. I think he's gone back to nick a car. Maybe. Anyone here? Um, I'm heading my... over, but not, not yet. I think I'm on the way. Hello. Oh, oh okay. you did. Yeah, okay. you did. It doesn't. Yeah, yeah. There's no kill message, so I didn't know. And you were in a bush. 